Welcome to VZ Fit, the exercise system that turns your body's own movement into virtual travel anywhere in the world. This tutorial will show you how to ride VZ Fit with just your body, but you can also connect it to smart stationary bikes and other fitness devices. You're now standing on the Exer board. It's like a segue you can exercise on. To safely exercise, you need to be able to reach all the glowing orbs around you. If you can't reach them, move to a more open spot in your room, and then hold down the Oculus Home button to recenter the Exer board. Notice that red lights and a warning sound will play when you're on the edge to keep you safely centered. Please reach out with your hand controllers to touch the orbs now. Look down to see your power meter. It determines how fast you'll travel by detecting the motion of your arms and head around the exer board. Try walking in place and swinging or pumping your arms to get the meter to change from green to yellow to orange now. You can adjust the difficulty of the power meter to match your size and physical ability. Look up at the difficulty buttons and tune them up or down until you feel it matches your workout level. The white dots ahead of you represent the path you can take through the Google Street View images of the world. You've got company. The trainer ahead of you will perform moves that you can copy or decide to move in your own way. Walking in place with your arms pumping is a great way to start. Select Continue to begin your first ride. Start moving now. Feel free to look around while the extra board automatically steers to follow the white dots. Take a break after you collect the coin along the road. Nicely done. Let's take a break. Congratulations, you're now an explorer. Look up to check out the heads up display. It shows how many coins you have, how much of a ride is remaining, and your fitness stats. Below that is the pause button, which you'd normally hit to go to the pause menu but just click it now to continue. Next, we want to show you some riding options that can help with VR comfort and immersiveness. You would typically change these from the pause menu, but we'll try each one together now. The first option is to change your riding perspective to third person to see your own avatar. Click continue to make that change. There you are! Now ride to the next coin along the road to see how it feels, then stop again. Nicely done! Let's take a break! You can customize your avatar later from the main menu and purchase new items with the coins you collect on rides. Your avatar will also be seen in snapshots you take and by other riders in online play. If you felt more comfortable in first person view, you can switch back now or continue in third person. Next, you'll try steering yourself. This can increase immersion and give you more control when following a path. It also allows you to turn wherever you want when creating open rides. To steer, slightly tilt your head to the left or right as you're moving. Try to follow the path of the white dots for the best visual experience. Continue to the next coin and stop again. Nicely done. Let's take a break. We're going to switch you back to automatic steering because it's easier when working out on the extra board, but try it later if you liked it. It works especially well when you're using a stationary bike. Now let's ride somewhere else. VZ Fit comes with dozens of suggested rides, but you can also create your own rides all over the world, as well as find and share them with the rest of the VZ Fit community. Welcome to Paris. Cities have more traffic and buildings, so rides can look better in city mode. You can always turn that on during a ride from the pause options menu, but we'll place you in that mode now. 
Notice how city mode draws a virtual road and makes buildings appear more solid at a distance. You can also see points of interest along your path. The main goal of VZ Fit is to finish rides. The first time you finish any ride, you'll receive double the coins you collected along its path. Ride to the finish line now to claim your bonus. Great job! Some rides may take just one session, but longer ones may take days. If you want a change of scenery, you can leave and resume any ride without losing your progress. Now let's switch back to country mode and head for the coast. You can keep more engaged during a ride by completing workouts. When you select a trainer workout from the pause menu, the trainer will perform different exercises to go slower and faster over periods of time as designed for that workout. Here's a sample workout to get you started when you're ready. Circle arms all the way up. You earned that one. Get ready to floor it. Yeah! You're on fire! Take it easy for a moment. Great workout! Be sure to take some time to cool down. Excellent workout! You've now finished up the intro tutorial, but can replay it from the main menu when your friends and family want to try VZ Fit. There are many more features to discover by watching our other tutorials, going through all the menus, and visiting us at vzfit.com.